How you doing? It's George at Wicked Warnings here in Chicago, Illinois. We did a nice brand new Super Duty in a green and amber theme for two reasons. One of the uh, reasons is the new green rules going on with snow in the Midwest and how green is a better light for snow and warning. Uh, the other is the personal preference of the client for green and amber for one of his favorite football teams. Uh, check this out. In the headlights on Auxiliary 3, we went ahead with Nova X600s in an X pattern. With these light heads, you also get the ability to wire in a pattern button that allows you to change the patterns. Pattern, that one the camera won't even pick up, it's so fast. Pattern, pattern, pattern pattern the last one is steady burn which is actually pretty neat uh, you can light the lights green and amber and uh, and just have steady burn uh, very cool to be able to select the patterns on all the lights as you go the rear works the same way when we get to it you'll see pattern this is actually my favorite pattern we also went on with this truck with auxiliary 4 it has a dash light has the atomic roof lights has the wicked warnings mirror mod it also has fog pocket leds which i'm a great fan of for snow plows or trucks that tend to creep out into traffic and you'll see the intersection warning that you get here is great with those green fog pocket leds on the side of the truck we complemented the fog LEDs with a TIR on the front step and a TIR on the rear step. We also flashed the mirrors. On the rear of the truck, we went ahead with a TIR 3 in amber on the 45 part of the bumper right there for some rear intersection warning as well as green and red in the hideaway in the tails and green in the cargo light above we also added in TIRs rear facing in green and a pair of TIRs under the gate in amber to the rear of this truck We synced up the TIRs under the gate. We also synced up the tail lights and the reverse lights into an X or into, into top and bottom pattern back here because I wanted to fire both of those beautiful green lights and the hideaways in the reverse at the same time. Uh, it's just very pretty through that reverse lens with the green. And I alternated the top uh, cargo to match the alternating green on the bottom uh, on the license plate. Uh, so not only we have the alternating amber in the back under the gate, we have the alternating green and we have the green and red alternating as well. One thing that didn't quite make it into this time frame for this video is the flush mount. Six LED pods which are going to be right here in the bumper. They're uh, going to be in a video very soon, perhaps tomorrow night. The other thing we did with this customer's request for the backup alarm is uh, he plows some areas uh, and sometimes even going forward with a snow plow you'd like an alarm. Uh, uh, it's not always in reverse that you need to let people know what's going on. So uh, we went ahead and tied in the backup alarm into auxiliary two. So it'll work anytime you want. Off. So he can run it forward, backward, anytime he wants. We're gonna go ahead and sweep back around to the front of this truck. Give you another look. There's our assistants in there running our switches. The intersection clear is so good with that fog right there. And you're creeping out with the snow plow.
Thanks for watching. Get it here at Wicked Warnings.